rigged. It's like, oh, it's a set that I'm never, ever, ever going to use and looks hideous. I think I've gotten one decent looking <laughs> out of like 12 spins. So Dota 2 is going on elsewhere. So Bottom lane, it's going to be DJ picking up the first kill, believe it or not, and he takes down Sonico yeah, here. Yeah, they there to the west, so... No. Yeah. Then you get Mask of Madness and farm with that, though. That's where you get the farm from in Medusa. Medusa. No bottom lane, they fire fight up. terrible, honestly. It's really good, with the deduction on the mana. Rages, but Mask of Madness isn't that bad that. anymore. They buffed it a couple of times yeah. since that mass of their... I think it's okay. Okay, we got a... Got a little bit of a scuttle happening here in the bottom lane. Ohio very deep looking to toast up Sonico. Looks like they'll be able to get it. Toast I mean, DJ is so tanky for a support. He's got like okay. four level one. Oh, oh. Sorry, oh, tower gotcha. What was that range? <laughs> Dragon Lance Tower. <laughs> <laughs> Something ridiculous. What's really fun is that definitely not Dota custom mode. I've heard some things about it. I have not checked it out. It's personally. pretty hilarious. It's one big meme. <laughs> Sounds like it will win over well in Dota. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, Suniko. Gotta be careful here. His Zimbus is up for eight. He's super dead. Yeah. yeah. Bumps him back. Please hit me once. Slap him. Oh, oh he chooses to DJ. go for DJ instead. DJ with the tank. Roshan's biased. They're Enigma. They're gonna come out with the the Magnus initiation. So. Do you think that's go time for Navi then? Mech on Enigma. Let's Maybe start that's... getting some tier twos. Or tier ones rather. Be like 15 okay. For that okay. RP skewer so, back on Mushi. Mushi trying to. Talking about. Like, <laughs> let me just walk away here from this fight and walk away from the trouble. And then he's only level five. Worse. Still oh. can't kill him. There's a shuriken. One more. Oh! Oh. Uphill doesn't forgive you. Sorry. Take him down. On the <laughs> yeah. Please finish him off. That was a lot of sweat. I can't believe he wasn't level down. six. If he were level six, that would've been. So 85 seconds, I believe, at level one. So, problem is, are we going to see a potential deja vu performance from uh, this timber? Oh, RP for Moosh. No song here. Skewer back. Oh, that hurts a lot. Best pop. Mid one's join mid lane, and uh, with the Chrono coming out, General will help secure the kill on Mooshi. Fight here if they have disruptor. Yeah, they have the glimpse. Dendi will get glimpse back. Oh, only oh, level chocolate. six yet. And uh, now Dendi on the run here, but not going to be making it too far. Fnatic will easily swarm in and get their own redemption kill. Uh -oh. Can they make it more, though? They're trying to run in for Ditya, but he pops the rage and runs away, along with General and company. He's hanging out inside Sonico right now. He has 1,500 gold, so yeah, I'm, I'm not sure. He's a Deso here really soon. He they might, echo they save might, right now. might run into mid one here. He just jumped to a nearby camp. Oh. oh, I think they may have saw each other here. Radiance bottom tower. I mean, oh, no, it's gonna go. Okay, they're swarming in. There's gonna be the pop. Yeah, One looking for a chain. Takes it out, gets bumped back. And it looks like they may be able to burst oh, him. Except that DJ oh, shows no. up, and it's gonna be bad. They drop down the stack storm right on top of Nobby's head. And it could be bad. They quickly burst down one. They get another, and Ditya could be the third target in this one. Beautiful setup from Fnatic. Did you? Oh, missed the chain, so they can't quite chase. Can he find a way out of here? He's trying to toggle his way. Oh, oh, there's nowhere to go. He's stuck now. Oh, the chrono. Dead man's alley, but there's a chrono behind on the mid one. He's turning. He's manning up on for DJ, but my God, as awkward as it is, he might be able to get the Naga, and he gets it done. Will he find his way out from here? He's looking for it, but mid one says no. No, you will not make your way out. Takes him down. Wow, what a setup from Fnatic. It doesn't even feel good when you're playing as Medusa. Yeah, it feels like such a poop spell when you're playing against it. It's like, STOP PRESSING R! Oh. Dendi hiding under it. This makes the jump. RP on the two. Scares him both right into the static storm. Oh, denied. No follow-up black hole gonna be happening for you. Artstyle does manage to wiggle his way out. Gets Thunderstruck up. Meanwhile, did your raw. Gets lassoed, pulled back. Looks like Navi will be able to clear out the disruptor on one end. Ditya Ra clears out the Batrider there, and well, it turns into a two for nil trade at the moment. But mid one, cracked up now, looking for somewhere to hide. And jumps right back Whoa. towards the secret shop and catches out the, the Enigma on the back line. Very cute play by mid one, but ultimately it looks like they will drop the Chrono and finish the machine off. So, back up to eleven charges. And as we saw, it looks like uh, they are making a move for a Roche, but based on that kill, they're having second thoughts, but they might be oh able God. to get a catch here for Timber. Is it worth the Black Hole? Looks like it is, with the help. Oh, Track Hole, play nice break, bump yeah. back, cancels it, and Midwall will get the room. The Timber chain away, so Nico's trying to chase after him here, but they see him. 
and he might regret that decision. It looks like he'll get bursted down next. Two go down all the way from Navi, and they're looking to make it three. There's a lasso up on Dityarod. They're pulling him right back towards Mushi. Do they have the firepower? I don't think they do. Looks like they're just going to be make it back under the tower, but they glimpse him right into a static storm setup. Kinetic field locks him there. Burst on board from mid one is going to secure that, and he gets a double kill now. Fnatic, they fight for them, and now they'll look to move on in for a tier two to make it a plus one. But he can still like they haven't been using their spells perfectly in yeah, fights, agreed. so Life Sword can still get a couple of easy kills. Dayra has been. It's been a force to be wrecked. Oh, here we Smoke. go. Clash in the mid lane. Denny looking for the opening. Catches out. Three here. Oh. DJ, though, says, sorry, buddy. Go to sleep. But from the backside, mid one is going to be able to creep in. Looking to go. Burst down art style before any sort of black hole can be had. Mushi committing the stone gaze really disrupts everything as they're going to be forced to split apart. General makes his move. Jumping in. Trying to focus. Mushi gets oh, both him and Ohio in a chrono. Will quickly take down one. Ditcher rock on the inside. Pumps out of the end. Gets Mushi down. And now they look for the mighty machine here. Can they get mid one? He's, he's trying his best. To, can he timber chain? He's got he's to fail now. They're not going to let him go. He has slowed down those open wounds. Two seconds, has a wand, skewered back. Tries to wand up, tries everything he can, but he's not going to make it out. Navi, take a big fight on this one. Denny with the double at the end. Navi team fight, we see it time and time again. Static Storm and his Static Storms like haven't really been like that amazing. Just, just yeah, just the one in the jungle. I wouldn't really be too spooked of it to be honest. And they're also like they kind of will save the Static Storm for like if they can blow somebody up. And General's not gonna. Oh, whoa. Okay, General Chrono catch on Mushi. There's going to be the song here. As Ohio also just happened to link up to Chira, so that lasso oh, is not going to be doing a whole lot. Set up with a static field, but that's where General pops BKB. Oh, Arsenal swing and a miss on the black hole. Not going to be good enough on this one. And it's 1-1 one, one apart, but Navi losing their life stealer means that a lot of the damage in bulk is going to be gone. BKBs have been used. Mid one now looking to clean up who's left. They'll have an RP, but yeah, yeah, he's sitting on it. Most of their damage is off the table. Yeah, now. so we might have to just pocket it for now. Gem down. Looks like it was picked up, though. Soneko. Yep, he grabs, so he has two. And one has been trying his best to get any scavengers here. It looks like he'll settle on art <coughs> style. No more trees in the nice area. Blink. <laughs> he blinked when he fogged him. Attack. Wow. That actually could have been a lot worse for Navi, I feel. Definitely. But Definitely. Fnatic are the one who actually lose more. It, it begins... it they really really they can last, jump. So. Yeah. They scan, they're not hiding in the trees. They've got very good positioning. Oh, they might be able to catch that. Uh, they might not him. see him. Do they see him? Oh, oh, they see him. He BKBs. He runs in. Both of BKB. Ohio grabs the one. The dig buff pullback. RP cancels the pullback. General jumps in at the black hole, but it's going to quickly shut down. And now the stack storm to field is going to be dropped here. Chrono responds from General. Catches out three, but do they have the firepower? It looks like they may. Mid one being focused, and now DJ's going to get the sleep off. And it's, it's for Fnatic to reposition here. Surrounding Soniko, can they burst down the bounty hunter first? Meanwhile, General gets a killing spree, is able to clean up the disruptor. Mushi, gotta get back, forced out to safety. Meanwhile, on the other side, Soniko somehow barely living away. Midwan will finish the job, taking out Dendi. Dijira, hops out of his little backpack. Oh, ends up bouncing back with the help of the Lotus Orb, but Dijira, the new focus on Ohio. Fnatic trying to kite their way around this life stealer. General makes his own new approach. Can he finish Ohio? Yes, he can, but General. Oh, time walk, barely lives, but now they got him with the net. They'll go down, that's a gem on the deck, which they'll step back for in a moment. Did Gerard, though, persistent, be able to get the finish there from Mushi. Can he fight him in man mode on the mid one here with the help of Soniko coming back in? Looks like they'll get the Aegis, and that may be the end of this one. I don't think that could have gone better for Fnatic, and yet Navi, no one's still able to kill off the Gerard. General's still an extremely difficult kill. Like using Gaga 5 and stuff. Um, because they kind of like have damage issues right now. I don't really think he needs like the mobility from Blink that wow. much. Wow, they spot Mushi and they immediately make a jump here. Arsal even going to be committing the follow up black hole just to ensure this one. General commits the chrono, stops Mid One and Ohio from coming in, so they're going to get the finish kill on Ohio. Song comes out from DJ, allows Mid One to step out, but uh, Fnatic are still going to be fighting with less in numbers, so that means they're going to quickly end up losing the rest. Only Mid One to survive on this one. Navi feels that they commit very hard for Mushi, but the follow-up is just as nice. And... I think in the sleep, yeah. two is probably two of the ultimate enough. heroes at least. I, I don't uh, know if they've scouted the eggs or not, but yeah. Navi is having pretty good positioning right now. It's kind of hard.
Uh, no. His rage is gonna expire. You know, he has he has the Aegis, I guess they're just gonna sack it. And Dendi might be just waiting to go for an RP. I don't know if he can hope he can get it done before a song, but there he goes. Long blink in, almost a rise style, goes right for Destructive Meanwhile General, gets the nice catch of the Naga, that means there's gonna be no song at all. Black Hole on the other side, locks down three, and Navi could quickly clean it up. They drop down three, that's the second RP from Dendi. They make it four. Minwon, the last to survive, is able to at least creep in one kill for Fnatic, finishing up art style, but it might be just too little too late. He gets dropped in. That means that Navi can really open up in this mid lane. Fnatic are gonna be forced to dish out whatever buybacks they can in hopes to survive, but I think Navi, might have just taken the first dominant step in this one. Really nice by General finding the Naga. That's that's really all he needed to do with his Chrono Spear. Needing a lot of damage there, he decides to hop on the back of Dendi and go ride him out to safety. Midwan goes in, and they'll get the cleanup, taking down Soniko here. But uh, now Minwan, who's happy to just look past any sort of butterfly evasion, will just try to burst down the Faceless Void. It looks like he wasn't able to get him. Well, on the other side, Ditcha Rock committing the Abyssal Stun from Mushi, and uh, now he's in trouble. Oh. He's not being just got out while you can, but nonetheless, they will hand over a couple of free kills here to Fnatic. It's a good swing of net worth for him. Not a lot of backs, though. He didn't actually get the Rex, though. Yeah. That's a bit of a concern. Huge. Pretty much team wipe there for him. Hammer and rapier sound similar in relation. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Roland? <laughs> okay, here they go. The Let's foray see. outside of the base. And mid one, make it count. Dendi's pops his BKB. Oh General gets a chrono for Mushi. The song comes out, but. No, obviously General not going to be put to sleep here. Ohio gets the grab pull back to Jira, but there goes the black hole. Catches out two. That's going to quickly take care. And yeah, with that Agnum, you can see the life force just quickly spettling down. Dendi pops off his new RP. Mushi still stands. He's trying his best to fight the whole thing off, but now they have easily outnumbered Fnatic in this one. They wipe through the team. DJ the lone survivor, but here comes Navi parading down the bottom lane. Imminent to go for the last set of racks and go for the win. When you try to walk out from the fountain of a black hole, wait for you, but that's going to do it. Art style, give us the black hole of the win. Well played, sir. Navi have done it in this series, and they will move on into the next round. Fnatic eliminated from the Summit 5. It felt like Fnatic had the picks to deal with them, but it just Navi just got too much out of the early game. You got three ults like that. You only have to hit 1.7 hero per ult to, to have the full lineup controlled. So Deira, I think, played especially well. He, yeah, yeah. I think, carried the brute force of the early game, and then I think that General farmed really well, too, which is kind of difficult when you're void. You often want to fight a lot. Navi.